BC's Exotics here. We're going to be making another video. I posted two earlier, and we're going to be posting another one today. Another one, so I've got three that I'm about to post. This will be my third video today. Well, my third video today I'm going to post. And I'll get back to you on just a second. BC's Exotics. So guys, it's winter break and we're going to do stuff this whole, these whole two weeks on YouTube. I'm going to be posting. Since I don't have any school, I'm going to be posting every day these two weeks. So as y'all can see, Lucian's behind me right now. And I told y'all he's going dormant and I'm not making a lot of videos with him. But yeah. So, we are going to be, someone's burning their tires, doing a burnout. Well, we got retards where we live, so. We're going to be holding him. This might be the last video I'm going to take with him. So, yeah. So, he's on my shoulder now. And he's like really warm too. So look at him. I don't know why he's not as aggressive as he was. He's kind of getting active now. He's been getting up and stuff. But he's been sleeping on the rock in his cage. I'm not going to be showing the cages in the video right now. Well, not in the video at all. I'm not going to be showing them. But yeah, there he is. He's gotten big, pretty big. So, this isn't the end of the video. I'm going to make this at least four minutes long. He's got at least... 15 years left of his life right now because we think he's been alive for five years but we're not sure so but okay guys so we got the python out right now he's like pretty angry at me or he sh he's pretty angry because he's shedding if you see look at all that shed flaking See that? I'm not going to hold him a lot. See, he's gotten on this all of it off right here on the back. But once you get off of that right here, right there, look, he's got it all cleaned off right there. Once you get to the back, it's gone. All that cleanness is just gone. Once you get to his head, too, look at that. He is shedding a lot lately. Like, that means he's going fast. So, I don't, don't want to put him in discomfort right now. But he probably is, so I'm not going to hold him for a long time. If you look, it's all, it's all over my finger. On my hand. Look. Look how big he's gotten. He's not going to get that big. He's probably just going to get about maybe almost four foot. And it, the video cut off, so I'm going to. So I just edited the other video I just took into it. So yeah. Next one, we're going to get the gecko. We're going to put him up. So yeah, here we go. So guys, he tried to strike at me, the snake. He tried to strike at me right when I tried to put him back. He opened his mouth, like he didn't open it before he struck. He just struck and it like, he almost got my hand, but yeah. I'm not afraid of him. If he bit me, he bit me, I don't care. I mean, he most likely had a reason that he bit me, so. We've got the gecko right here. Look at him and how tiny he is. See that? So, 
There he is, the little gecko. There's nothing really to talk about about him. But yeah, he's like, we're thinking that he's like a dwarf or something. Look at him. Sorry, I was looking at the snake. But look at him. He's tiny. We've had him for about three months already. He was just yawning or something. He was opening his mouth. I don't know what he was doing. It didn't look like he was yawning, but I mean, he could have. But here's the gecko. Just tiny little fella. So, that'll be the end of the video. I'll come back at you with some BC's exotics.